What's up, man? So, this is Brian. Hey, how you doing? You're a Ninja Tech guy. And I am, I currently just opened up a brand new Dell. It's, um, Inspiron, Inspiron, there it is right there, 3252. And this is what's happening right now. I am doing a factory image restore because, um, for some reason, this is what concerns me, and I, I want to talk about this. So, um, all of the documents that I'm finding about resetting and creating Microsoft accounts and all this, they have this URL, live.microsoft, right? And when I click it, it's dead. It goes to live.microsoft, and it's dead. So, here's my thinking. Like, okay, if this isn't working and Dell is bringing you to this to set up an account, right? Um, and this is dead, then where's the account go? If you're making a computer account and the computer account is a live Microsoft account, where's the account going if this URL is dead? So that's where I'm at right now is I set up a brand new computer, right? And it didn't let me log in after I set up the account, set up the password, wrote the password down, cannot log in. So I called Dell and they said, obviously I got in some Indian person that couldn't speak a word of English um, and it was just really frustrating talking to her. She had absolutely no technical knowledge at all and didn't even know what should be on the computer screen. So she ended up asking me a bunch of questions and telling me to send her pictures of my computer, pictures of the screen, pictures of my receipt, all this proof of purchase garbage. I'm just trying to get tech support through Dell. That's it. So I ended up finally asking her, I'm like, can't we just reset this stupid thing? Nobody knows how to reset this. I've looked on the, on the internet. How do you reset Windows 10 back to factory? How do you reset Dell back to factory? Nobody says anything. So this was so simple. You hold the shift key down, right? Um, see if you can see it. You hold the shift key down. And over here on the right where your power is on Windows 10, you press restart and you hold the shift key down while you're pressing restart. And then this cool screen pops up, this blue screen, and it actually gives you uh, all kinds of options about resetting, diagnostic, and all this stuff. So if you don't know about shift, it's pretty awesome. Um, that's what this video is teaching you. So this is Brian with Ninja Techs. Check out some of my other videos on my channel. And uh, I'll see you later. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a comment if you loved it.